Sure. Apple's challenge for the next Vision Pro, making it easier to wear, is the headline. Apple is already work on their next generation models. You know, the, the, the design for the current model is locked in. They're just trying to scale up the manufacturing and all that. A key focus for Apple is making its device more comfortable to wear with a smaller and lighter design. The first model, the Vision Pro, has caused neck strain in testing due to its size and weight. <clears throat> Another challenge is making the headset simpler for people who wear glasses. During the development of the first Vision Pro, Apple decided to slim down the device by emitting room for prescription eyeglasses. I've I've tried like an Oculus Rift mm -hmm. here and there, and you know that that device is significantly bulky because they intend for you to put it on over top of your glasses. And if you have oh, like giant glasses like I do, you know that that means that the device sticks out further for everybody. And it makes it front heavy, now. right? Because it's sticking yeah, out far, yeah. yeah. Mm. I mean, the Vision Pro, it's it's also made of like glass and aluminum, so right? Mm -hmm. It sort of, it sort of closely matches the the contour of your face because they they didn't leave the room for the glasses. But the the downside there is that of course you need to because you're not wearing your glasses. If you have god awful eyesight like I do, I just went in for another eye test last week. My eyesight has gotten even worse. If you understand what the numbers are. Uh, my, I think my left eye is like minus five and a quarter and the other one is four and three quarters. Okay. Terrible eyesight. But anyways, Apple's selling like these little inserts made by Zeiss Optical that you're supposed to like attach in instead, but that makes it cumbersome to just hand to somebody because very few people have eyesight as bad as I do. I can't just hand somebody my Vision Pro if I were to get one. Yeah. It's more expensive because yeah. we don't know what the cost of those lens inserts is going to be i'm not even sure if they're user replaceable either because they're they come with the pre-installed prescription right from the factory really? i think oh i th i thought they were i think no, i don't think that's i right. thought i remember hearing that they're that they're pretty easy to do because what okay. we've heard from the people who showed up for the live demos is that uh you know people like mike hurley who wear glasses like they they took his glasses for a moment they like scan the curve of the glass and then they estimate your, what, what your prescription was like they had a machine for that ready to go and then they quickly found matching lenses and just attached them in and had it ready oh, for. oh interesting them. well they they attach magnetically right something like that i, I think okay. they do anyway we don't need to go Anyways, on on and on about the glasses this, is but, one yeah. Problem, but yeah the other problem is that like it's going to be really heavy other people are saying that um and you can see this in like one of the shots on their announcement video they have an optional top strap that goes over the All top right. of your head as well they just don't show it in most of the promotional artwork right. because apparently like the design for it isn't completely finished yet, okay. but mm -hmm. it's another way they're trying to uh, disguise the problem of how heavy this thing is going to be. Yeah. I mean, the fact that some people got neck strain, I mean, that was the part that jumped off the page to me. I'm like, it's so heavy that people are straining their necks wearing these. Now, look, if you wear AirPods Max, those things are heavy and I would say they could give you neck fatigue. Maybe that's the same thing as neck strain. I don't really know what neck strain necessarily means. It's like, but neck strain <laughs> means that like, does that just mean fatigue or does that mean like you're actually injuring your neck? <laughs> I don't know. I don't the, think it means injury. I don't think there's been. Any I don't mean injuries. like you're gonna wear like one of those like uh, those those things that you wear when you get a car accident around or, your neck. Go to court after a car accident. <laughs> no, yeah, it exactly. Just means you'll wear one of those like neck pillows. You wear on an airplane. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it comes with a free inflatable neck pillow or something. I just thought that was surprising. I was like, "Holy cow! Like it's that heavy that people like their their like their necks and and maybe these are just like puny neck having individuals like Alexi Heath. <laughs> I mean, normal regular men like us, like our necks, you know, can hold lots of weight, but like his, are, you know, is small. I mean, it's not quite as small as a pencil, but it's in that pity, same realm. You know, pity the pencil neck geeks. <laughs> so maybe that's the problem, but. But I, I was surprised to, to, to read that. And I was like, you're supposed to be able to wear this thing all day. And some people are, are having neck strain and uh, are the having battery to only lasts for two hours, right? Well, you could have it plugged in all day. Apple says yeah. it has all day battery life when it's plugged in. <laughs> <laughs> Perfect. Isn't that funny? Isn't that That's like really more funny. More than being tethered by, uh, you know, right? I hate plugging. I, I'm so into the wireless headphones and stuff. I, I Every time I now have to put on these uh, wired ones for the cold cast, I'm just like, God, it just seems so antiquated. I know. I hate having the cord hang off as well. Uh, Isaac from the chat saying, I experienced neck, neck strain when I first got a Quest 2. It's just that you're not used to having it on your head. You get used to it after a while. Yeah, maybe that's it. You'll get used to it after a while. But um, I don't know, man. 
the uh, the Vision Pro looks pretty hefty, and when you put glass on it, that is a heavy material. So I'll be curious to try this out. But I did th I did th think that was interesting because I was like, oh, I've, I've not heard anyone comment about this yet. And clearly it must be an issue if Apple is already working on it for the next Vision Pro version because people are complaining that it's giving them neck strain. So it must be more than a small issue. But we'll have to uh, wait and see. 